As the economic gains from a rebounding tourism sector continue to be realized, President of the Bahamas Hotel and Tourism Association Robert Sandy Sands called on the government to avoid creating more red tape through legislation and instead roll out the red carpet for the hospitality industry that employs so many Bahamians. Sands was addressing critical issues that are hampering the growth of the tourism sector at the annual Bahamas Business Outlook on Thursday. Any future legislation uh, that impacts uh, certainly the Bahamas and all the hospitality industry has to be one that is red carpet and not red tape uh, so that it does not create the impediments to this momentum of growth that is currently taking place. The veteran hotelier says among the biggest issues facing hotels is electricity costs and the lack of airlift. A huge issue uh, for, for many of our hospitality hotels and throughout the Bahamas is cost-effective and efficient, reliable power uh, that can exist throughout the entire archipelago. As it relates to airlift, he says if local hotels are going to continue to grow their businesses, the country has to grow airlift capacity, but more importantly, fix the cost of airlift capacity. There's a saying in, in the travel business, you know, it's cheaper to fly beyond the Bahamas than to come to the Bahamas from the United States. Sands also pointed to the need for hotels to begin to purchase much more goods produced locally and for work to be done to improve downtown and historical venues. He noted that hotels themselves do not make a destination. Reporting for Guardian News Network, I'm Jasmine Brown.